dear customer welcome to vst tiller family at vst we dedicate ourselves as a team to provide total crop solutions to enhance farm productivity Our innovative products have earned the goodwill of farmers for its unparalleled quality and reliability. VST Sales and Service Team presents VST Shakti 130 Di Power Tiller Installation Video. This video is a visual guide to help you to undertake proper maintenance of your VST tiller for long, trouble-free usage. The VST tiller comes with operator manual. and service log book the service log book has detailed descriptions of the following sale intimation and installation training certificate warranty details log sheet five free service coupons now let's look at the free spares and tools nine left and nine right bent tines with nut and bolts spring washer tiller cover wheel changer and starting handle in this section let's identify the different parts of the tiller Kindly quote the engine number and the chassis number for all kinds of communication with VST dealers, regional sales offices and VST engineers. Engine maintenance. Coolant capacity and level. Check the coolant water level every day and make sure it is never below the minimum level. If you need to add more coolant, Use a mix of 1 is to 3 ratio or 3 parts of distilled water and 1 part of company recommended coolant for better performance. Change coolant every 6 months or after the completion of a season. Engine oil level. Check the engine oil daily. To change the engine oil Follow these simple steps. Run the engine for minimum 3 to 5 minutes and stop it. Remove the drain plug of the engine oil pan. Drain all the oil and refit the drain plug. Once the engine cools, fill recommended genuine engine oil up to the upper level mark on the dipstick. Air cleaner bowl. We are using the three stage oil bath type air cleaner in outlets check oil level in the air cleaner daily fill the engine oil up to the level marked on the air cleaner oil bowl
Proper maintenance of air filter will improve the engine life. And it must be cleaned at the time of oil change or as and when required depending on oil quality. During dry land operation, clean the air filter every day and during wet land operation, clean the air filter once in three days. Engine Start System Before starting the engine, ensure accelerator is in full acceleration mode and check if all gears are in neutral position. To start the engine, use the starting handle fitted on the holder. Insert the starting handle into the starting shaft. Pull the decompression lever with the left hand. Rotate the starting handle clockwise 4 to 5 times. It will allow the lubricating oil to reach all moving parts. Once you're sure the momentum is enough to start the ignition, release decompression lever. Fuel system and air bleeding. Fuel filter must be cleaned every 50 hours and changed every 100 hours. Clean the fuel tank every 500 hours. Periodically remove water condensed on fuel filter cover or water separator. Open the fuel tap and remove the fuel pump nut. Check for continuous fuel flow. And as diesel seeps out, the air bleeding is removed. Then tighten the nut. Fan pulley and fan belt tension. The fan belt size of the tiller is A38. Check the fan belt tension every day by pressing the middle of the belt with your finger as the load of 5 kg pressure. Ideally, it should move between 10 to 12 mm. To adjust the fan belt, first loosen the lever idle securing bolt then tension the pulley idle by loosening the nut and adjust by loosening or tightening as required. Set the tension and lock the nut and full tighten the idler pulley assembly. Gearbox Maintenance V-Belt Adjusting System Check and adjust the B67 V-Belt Tension up to half inch at the load of 5 kg pressure. To adjust the belt, first loosen the four engine bedding bolts. Remove both the 8 mm V belt cover nuts. Adjust the bolt tension in the front side. Tighten the bolts and nuts. Gear oil capacity and changing period. The gear oil has a capacity of 5.5 liters and must be checked daily. Grade of gearbox oil SAE 90 grade. Make the first oil change after 50 hours and then after every 200 hours using recommended genuine oil. If found dirty, 
Oil can be changed as and when required. Gear change. For changing gear, first the vehicle should be stopped. If changed while running, it will damage the gears. Tire pressure. Ensure that the tire pressure is set for field operation 18 psi and for road operation 20 psi. Check the pressure daily. Rotary maintenance. Rotary mounting bolt. Tighten the rotary mounting bolt every day. Rotary chain case oil level and changing period. Check rotary chain case oil level daily. The capacity is half litre and must be changed in the first 50 hours and then after 150 hours with recommended genuine oil. General Maintenance Once you've completed work, ensure the tiller is cleaned completely. Regularly check and tighten all bolts and nuts for safety. Greasing Points all the board and cables must be oiled every 50 hours. Grease tail wheel bearing and bush every 50 hours. Replace grease and rotary cup every 100 to 150 hours. Make sure you replace the gasket after refilling grease. Main clutch lever play adjustment. Main clutch lever free play should be 10 to 15 mm. If not, Remove the nut from the main clutch rod. Adjust the bottom end of the clutch rod by rotating it. Tighten the nut and check the free play again side clutch lever play adjustment side clutch lever free play should be 2 to 3 mm if not loosen the cable adjuster lock nut adjust the cable by rotating it lock the nut and check the free play again free services company is providing five free services for periodical maintenance within the first year. First service, 50 hours or one month. Second service, 150 hours or three months. Third service, 250 hours or five months. Fourth service, 350 hours or seven months. Fifth service, 450 hours or nine months. VST Shakti Genuine Oil to protect customer's vehicle for the failure from local or non-genuine oil, VST has introduced VST Genuine Oil, which is available only with VST authorized dealers. VST supply oils, coolant and grease in the name of VST Shakti brand. Use genuine oils for better performance. VST Shakti, 
135Ti Ultra Power Tiller. The new VST Shakti 135Ti Ultra has additional features when compared to 130Ti Power Tiller. New Headlight Design Digital Hour Meter New Fuel Filter Change in Radiator Design Diesel Tank Change with Sheet Metal New Sticker Design New Muffler Detachable Rotary With Seat Attachment Implements Usage Different implements of VST Shakti Power Tiller and the Usage VST Power Tiller has 6 forward and 2 reverse gears. Low range gears are used for various field operations. High range gears are used when the trailer is attached for transportation purposes. The rotary has 2 standard speeds as well. Forward speed of the Power Tiller ranges from 1.5 to 14.5 km per hour. Power tiller rotary is fitted with 18 bend or straight tines depending upon the soil conditions. The straight tines are used on hard soil and bend tines are used for perfect pulverization of soil. The average tilling depth is 120 mm to 150 mm and the width is 540 mm to 600 mm. Fuel consumption is at a most economical level of 1.2 litres per hour, which may vary depending on soil and operating conditions. Under normal working conditions, one hectare of land can be covered in a day, which may vary depending on soil condition and operating conditions. For wet puddling, there should be 80 mm to 100 mm of water in the field for best puddle and proper levelling. Depending upon soil conditions, two types of wheels are used to achieve better results. Drum type cage wheels are used in heavy and sinking soil. Lugged wheels are used in non-sinking soil in place of pneumatic wheels for better traction. Tilling depth is 120 to 150 mm and field coverage is about 1 hectare per day. Different types of attachment can be attached to VST power tiller with the help of hitch bracket depending upon the field conditions. MB plough is used to plough virgin untilled land or where deep ploughing is required. Maximum range of ploughing is 200 to 250 mm. Cultivator is used after the harvest to loosen the soil and removal of weeds, grass, etc. Tilling depth varies from 120 to 150 mm and field coverage is up to 1 and 1.5 one and hectares a day. This implement can be used for intercultivation also. The ridging or burrowing attachment is fitted to the rotary assembly for making ridges or furrows. The furrows can be used for letting the water in the field and ridges for planting row crops such as potato, chilies, tobacco, banana and other vegetable crops. Basins can be made around the plant for applying manures and fertilizers apart from irrigational purposes. With rotary is used for formation of basins for pomegranate, mango, chikku plants and coconut trees. Spraying of pesticides is the most important operation undertaken periodically for all types of plants and crops. VST power tiller can be used as a prime mover for water pumps, for lifting water from wells, lakes and rivers for irrigation purposes. Normally a 3 by 2.5 inches centrifugal pump is recommended for a better outflow. The power tiller can also be used as a prime mover for driving an electrical generator to draw water from deep wells, to run threshers, crushers and lighting purposes. The power tiller is an ideal transporter too and can be attached to a one and a half ton capacity trailer to transport manure, seeds, etc. Intercultivation is done using the rotary for row crops. With a modified attachment, the power tiller is used in sugarcane fields 
unearthing up activities. For this operation, a shorter rotary and extended wheels are used to avoid any damage to the standing crops. Smaller ridge is used for earthing up activities and strengthen the bund around the roots. Sugarcane stubbles have to be completely rooted out in order to prepare the field for the next crop. Post hole digger is used for making holes. The power taken from main clutch per day, 150 to 200 holes, can be made. Potato digger is to remove the potatoes in the field. The power taken from gearbox by the rotary shaft per day field coverage 1.5 to 3 acres per day. PST power tiller can be operated with a remote control device too. PST toll free number. For more information or queries regarding service, please call our toll free number 1 800 419 0136.